So what happened? What happened? What actually happened? So what happened is that I saw them taking a protester and they were beating the guy. They were beating the guy. So you were inside there? Yes, I was inside when I saw them beating the guy. So I, I took my phone and I'm like, I'm, I'm filming this. No sooner had I took my phone that than six, it was even more than six. And just twisted my hand, bring the phone, bring the phone. And I said, oh, let's, let's hold on. Ah, before I could even say Jack, they pounced on me. And I'm like, these are policemen, not, a, not police women, policemen, policemen. And the way they twisted my hand, this person shake, shook me up. Push me yes. The other one pushed me yes. Bring the phone, bring the phone. And finally, I don't know where they, they took my phone. So they still have it. And the guy, one lawyer who told them that, oh, she's a journalist, leave her alone. They just started beating the guy, putting him, and now they took the guy to our So I can confidently tell you that if they said police are not beating protesters, it's a big lie. Me, a journalist, I have been assaulted by the police. How much more beating protesters is a lie? I have seen with my eyes how they hit the protesters there. And the lawyer who was representing me, they said, oh, she's a journalist, leave her alone. They were hitting, her with, hitting him with his foot, and they just squeezed him away. I said, no, we don't know even, we don't even know where he is. If someone says they are not beating protesters, I can tell you that it's a big lie because I have seen it. And the way they handled me over there. What's your, what's your name? What's your name? Vanessa. Vanessa, Vanessa Edotun